Proverbs 27, 19. As water reflects the face, so one's life reflects his heart. Hello, my name is Troy Beans with 78freethrows.com. Addiction. It's no fun to be addicted to anything. Sex addiction. The reality of sex addiction is sex in and of itself is a very good thing. Uh, it, it's a fabulous thing. It's created by God. It was made, you're made to be a sexual person. You know, if you're addicted to alcohol or drugs, or you, know, you weren't made to use those products. You weren't made to do that. Uh, and, you know, I'm not going to downplay any addiction because any addiction is hard and difficult and a struggle and no fun. Maybe the thing that's a little different between a sex addiction and an addiction to alcohol is it, you may want alcohol, but you got to go get it. You want sex, you're connected. It's in your body. You can deal with it right now, wherever you are. And that adds probably an element of difficulty to it. This last weekend, I was with a group of men who were there at this meeting for one reason only. They were there to deal with their sex addiction. And they, as the verse says, life reflects your heart. And they're realizing that their life is reflecting their, their actions are reflecting what their heart is about and they don't want to be that. The other thing about addictions is it's a choice. Now as hard as it is, difficult as it is, the thing that makes us human is our ability to choose. And yeah, we're addicted. We reach points where we're going to cave. We're going to give in. And so what was so powerful about this, this meeting that I was at is just the fact that men are admitting a problem. And we struggle to do that. We want to be strong. We're made to be strong. We are strong. But sometimes we're not strong enough. And it's powerful when a group of men get together and say, you know what, I need help. That's a powerful, powerful place to be. And these young men were, were texting each other throughout the week, talking to each other, talking about prevention. I'm, I'm, before I act out, I'm, I'm going to be texting someone. I'm going to be talk. I have people that I talk to, that I deal with with this issue, and they handle it. And I commend them for it. So you might ask, okay, so how in the world do you know that you might be a sex addict? Well, it, for you personally, if, if it's something you can't control, I mean, anything that you can say, oh, I'm not going to do that anymore, that's not good for me, and you stop, well, you're probably not addicted to it. But if you're like, oh, I, I, I can't, I, I got to have that. Or another way for married people. If you've been married for a while, and this may be for 20, 30 years, or it may be a year, and the idea of being at one comes up and you think in your head, I have no idea what it means to be at one. That concept doesn't make sense to you. And the reason it doesn't make sense to you that if you're acting out sexually on your own, it doesn't have to be pornography, it can be a, an imagination with other people besides your husband or your wife, then you're not at one. There's two, three, four, five hundred, whatever it may be. And until you commit sexually to one person only, you're not going to be at one. So sex addiction is a real thing. 
it's a struggle for a lot of men and women. Get help, get a friend, get on your knees. The power of God is the most powerful entity on this planet. Sex may be the most powerful emotion we have. God is the most powerful entity we have that we can go to and we can access. Also, if you're, there's a lot to do with brain research and how the brain responds to sex and, and how sex affects us. You can actually go to my website, 78freethrows.com, and I have a video there entitled, How to Prepare for a Great Sex Life Now. That video, I go through and I explain neuroscience, how your brain works, how it operates, how oneness occurs in the brain and how it doesn't occur. So if you're at all interested, I highly recommend you go to my website and get that video. And I'm going to give you a code today that will get you $10 off that video to be free of sex addiction or to, to have someone in your life to, for them to be free. It's a very powerful, powerful thing. For you guys who are married, and, and this probably applies more to women than men, but if you're thinking, you know, my husband just does not connect with me, that, that the, the oneness is missing, that's a tough subject to bring up. That's a tough thing to talk about. If you want to get to a higher level, if you want to get to the highest levels of marriage and understand this oneness. It's a subject that needs to be talked about, needs to be dealt with. And, you know, if you are addicted and you know you're addicted, at some point, you've got to talk to your spouse about it. You've got to believe in them. You've got to rely on them. Yeah, it's not going to be easy. It's going to be painful. But what's on the other side is well worth it, way more than worth it. So again, go to 78freethrows.com. The code to put in to get $10 off is free. F-R-E-E. -E. That'll give you $10 off and help you remain free of sex addiction or maybe it will help you be free of sex addiction. Love to hear your comments about this video. Talk to you soon.